Hello, everybody. I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on a set of Corsa, and we are in box cam. We are in stereo box cam, and we're going to be trying to drift in this camera view. I have a feeling this is going to be bad. We're on the mountain roads of the Deals Gap or Tale of the Dragon. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll follow in the description box below. Let's get to it. Not sure how this is really going to work because this is going to be very weird with camera. We do have the mint green neochrome OG energy innovations wheel back out. This is going to be very weird. Oh yeah. Oh, this is going to be super weird to do. And probably very challenging. Oh, dip in the toe. I cannot see where I'm going on some parts of this turn, so this is not good. We are in one of my street BMWs. I do love this car. This car is so nice. I mean, we're getting it. Oh, a little, little tire drop. This is super weird. I feel like oh, all those people that drift in first person all so lean don't know how to drift in third. I feel like this is exactly how they feel trying to drift in third. Oh my god, this is extremely challenging. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to totally survive a whole... Because this whole weird camera looks great, you know, cinematically for drifting and like replay angle but actually driving in this view it's extremely hard and i'm oh my gosh <laughs> and i am quite good with this m this m i cannot get over the weird rotational feel of this. No, we are going way off because I can't have a hard time of judging speed with this. And this is just a little bit of... Uh, challenging to say the least I think we're gonna go until we die then we may go into a normal view and see what it looks like actually drifting correctly with the box cam overlay oh my god It's so hard to judge angle and stuff in this view. Slowly starting to get it, I think. As I say that we go off course. Nope. <laughs> Where's the dirt? Oh, wow. So, do I recommend drifting in Box cam, definitely not. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm just beginning. So we're gonna go back to the pits. And we're gonna actually drive in the correct view. And we will have the box cam obviously up and running. Oh yeah, much more smooth. I, 
I forgot where I was for a second. See, when you're in the proper view and what you're used to driving, mountain roads are quite fun to drive in. This is the course that I would know pretty well, actually. Drifted it handfuls of times in the game, driven it in real life numerous times. Getting all the fancy feet work going in now. I should have popped in the fourth. Didn't want to send ourselves into the dirt. Ooh. Oh yeah. See, this is going to look so much better in the box cam view after the fact. Just flowing through the mountains right now. This BMW, definitely one of my favorite cars. How did we? Ooh, I think we may have hovered that front wheel over. Definitely killing it right now. We have really hot tires, though. Definitely tell. A little tire drop there. This is the smoothest I've ever done Fields Gap drifting before. This testament to these streetcars. Ooh, we got it. Oh, that's a little bit of a tire drop. Oh, we're good. We're good. Definitely can feel the tires getting really slippery. That was gonna be our first mess up, but we're not over yet. We got this. We're coming up close to the end of this run here. Big slowdown section, but we're doing this right. Oh, that's on off. I forgot that corner tightened up way quicker. We have no tires, so in my defense, we are able to throw this thing in fourth and lose traction. Oh yeah, we are hot tires. 
We are definitely out of tires. And I smoked through them. So, if you guys like this, you guys want to keep seeing more. Like, make sure you let me know down in the comment section. And as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track. Woo!